one day I saw a guy just doing a backflip off a wall and I was like, wow, that's the, the best thing I've ever seen. When I first discovered it, it was through seeing some movement in PlayStation uh, games and stuff like Assassin's Creed, uh, Mirror's Edge, a really popular one. Seeing how they moved um, really inspired me to want to do it. And when my brother said, oh, you can't do it, you're not fit enough to do that, that's, that was the one thing that triggered me to go out and try it. Parkour is challenging your body through exercises and your mind through the feel. We're always learning, constantly learning. Parkour <laughs> is many things. It is a sport, but for me, it's um, a kind of a sum of many sports. And um, sometimes it'll feel like dance, for instance. Sometimes it'll feel um, more in the martial arts. Sometimes it feels gymnastics. It's like you're bringing all the sports' uh, rawest um, moves into play around your urban area. And parkour for me is literally just taking little pieces and seeing what you can make out of it and how you can move through your city using those things. Parkour is a holistic movement discipline that people derive either a physical, technical or mental challenge from, depending on them as a person. Parkour is a way to see the world and when you start to practice and particularly with something that is in its nature a kind of deviation. Stairs are no longer stairs, a table is no longer a table. They become launch pads and landing points. It's a gateway, but it's, it's maybe more of like a clear gateway into this kind of sense of well-being. This is kind of a li lifestyle. You have to be quite hard on yourself. You have to be very honest with yourself. Even though you are having fun with most of the stuff, you're always testing your mind, pushing your um, mental abilities further and further and further. My ability to think around corners, display confidence, and basically figure out how to overcome any challenge that I'm, I'm faced with. Parkour taught me uh, <laughs> to be confident in my, my own abilities. Mental is the main thing that you always adapt, you're always adapting to your environment, always pushing your boundaries further, always testing your mind. That's the nature of parkour, to, to, to just pummel at a problem until you find a solution, trying it a thousand different ways and finding the one that suits you in the end. And the good thing about that is it uh, teaches you to basically not go full out there and just do whatever you want and not care about the consequences, but knowing what you're capable of and taking that risk so you can push yourself further, so you can adapt further. And for me, that helps with education a lot. Like, it taught me that uh, no matter your position now, you can always push for further. Around the world, the community is really big and you, th you can find a lot, a lot of good people. Like, just, we, we, we can go anywhere in the world and say, oh yeah, come to mine, you can sleep here if you want and we trust training after. I could end up spending the whole day with a random stranger just going around different hotspots and training and it's a safe environment as well. Because Park was a really big community, you're always talking, sharing, and really happy people in this community, which is really cool. And that you don't have to compare yourself to your friends, it's not a competitive sport. It's you go in your own pace. Parkour is it's a competition, but by yourself, just like how far you can go, how strong you can be, and every person is different. I can be good at jumping precision, you can be good at climbing. It's like you you can't really judge. Don't care what everybody looks at you. Don't care about what people think about you or what they say about you. Literally focus on yourself and don't be afraid to fail because you take the risk. In fact, the very best are the ones who take the risk and fail over and over again. But in the end, they come up triumphant. You can last forever. This is the thing in parkour, what we think is, it's not just being good for a moment, it's just being good for your life to always being constant in your training. It's also just such a positive thing to put your energy into.